Okay. All right. The skirmish on the bottom side and wanted to go ahead and take a risk. Score coming back around now. Parallel Convergence is going to be blocked by the Spell Shield from space, but there's the Wob someday and score get first blood as Echo doubles back around through the tri brush for the kill onto space. Yeah. And look TP, TP coming in, oh they're going to dive Helper. There's the Equalizer. It already cleared out the wave. They've got to wait. Can they prevent him from going through? Score coming around the outside. They want to bottle him up. They're going to dive him anyway. Helper getting low. Score is going Ooh. to pick up the kill in the end. And on. Oh, very low. Probably single digit HP right there. Pickaboo. I mean, CJ has no mana. If KT commits to this for a couple more waves, they should be able to eventually get this turn. What is Space Ooh. doing? Actually, has to parallel convergence coming in from the outside. Flash and the monsoon from Pikaboo. Space is certainly going down. Score picks up the kill with the chrono break. And there's a Gnar into the side. Ambition and Coco locked up behind the turret. And are we going to see Bad Life die? Also, yes, we will. Helper pick, oh, kill, picks up Pikaboo. Helper with a double kill already. Can he get in range of score? Actually, no. Score going to juke the other way. Get Gets saved by someday, but did Arrow get a kill in any of that is the question. No, he did not. No, he someday maybe looking for a flank right here. Yeah, he's he's gonna get seen. In he's the at river. three force rage. Uh oh, Carlo Convergence comes in, not gonna hit anybody. Ambition gets jumped on with a phase dive. Mad Life just going to disengage uh -huh. with a headbutt. They got a long way to go. Oh, someday go. gets in with the oh. one huge Darald into the wall. There's the equalizer, but it's going to only mitigate the damage that's already done. Someday, coming up with a big hop flash play. Wall. Are they going to go for a Baron in response, though? Well, Someday's wasting so much time right now. He's got two people down there. He's going to turn into Meganar. That's even more time. And there's the TP. There's no more crowd control. Goodbye. Oh. There's the headbutt. There's the Gnar. He dies. Wall. Are they going to go for a Baron in response, though? Well, Someday's wasting so much time right now. He's got two people down there. He's going to turn into Meganar. That's even more time. And there's the TP. There's no more crowd control. Goodbye. Oh. There's the headbutt. There's the Gnar. He dies. For KT. Well, Someday is on the side. They got uh, they got CJ Antis snarled up. Yep, and there they are. They're in the choke. They have to be careful about an equalizer. Here Ooh. comes Rumble. Where is the equalizer? Are they going to pop it now? Someday comes in. He gets into the back line. Space and Coco having a bit of a hard time, but Helper doing a great job of zoning on the outside. That is so much poke damage onto KT. KT just going to have to back off. Yeah, it's not. And Coco still has a lot of mana. Oh, but edge. edge goes straight into the fight. Ambition gets the kill. Arrow still killless oh. right here. They are going to get him. Oh, Arrow my. falls without cashing in on the stacks. And KT gets desperate. That was one Q. Yep. And they can get this turret. And will they get the inhibitor is the question here. I like how people, oh wow. Oh, Score just gonna go in with the parallel conversions. Helper's gonna get low right off the start. Is he Helper's gonna die? Gonna he actually die. goes down. And there's Draven cashing in a little bit late, but he'll take the money all the same. Mad Life has to use his ultimate, but it looks like they're not gonna be able to actually finish off this inhibitor. Pickaboo healing up his team as best he can off of this poke. Misses that wave. <laughs> Desperation Baron incoming from KT. They've got a lot of damage. Someday didn't even have time to fully heal in the base. They just are gonna go oh, for it. Boy. So risky. So risky, they it, but they're going to get it before Ambition can arrive. Big equalizer, but all those Sand Soldiers move forward. They've got some defense. Edge just trying to escape right now. Mad Life with a triple knockup. Arrow with the cleanse in the back. But Coco's do they have enough? The side. Yeah, Arrow's going to have to get out of there. Score. Does he oh. have enough to get over the wall? Two members of KT down. And that, oops, someday may be the next to fall. He's got a lot of MR. Coco's got no mana, but someday he's going to get the hop up. up. He's going to be all right. The boomerang to the slow, but Edge, they're going to go for the dragon. This is probably going to determine the outcome of this game. They're going to lose that turret. Uh-oh. Uh, CJ and Winions I mean KT, work. KT cannot leave. Their recalls are going to stop. There's the equalizer uh, coming through. Great. They're going to get the dragon. Maybe. Yes, they yep. will. KT grabs it, but can they last long enough for their Nexus not to die? Someday dies in the front line. Coco uh, very low, and Arrow and Pikaboo has to escape. Three down, and that's going to be it. CJ's going to take this Helper game. Helper should just TP around. Yes, there he goes. He's going to go right away for the win. CJ has some great shot calling late yep. to hold KT. KT in the mid lane, so a very exciting game is going to end with a CJ Antis victory. Well played by CJ Antis. KT also looked so good in the beginning, but...
like there was a pink ward down. Oh. And so Ambition still here. Score gonna try for a repeat gank yet again. Mad Life gonna face check a brush, but Ambition's at full HP. Pickaboo has to flash out immediately. There's oh, a flash follow. Ambition is there, grabs the lantern. Score does to get back in. Summoner heal, but Pickaboo is impressive. probably gonna give up first blood as space hops over the wall with a flash. Going for this with five members. Now Maokai's there, he's gonna pop his ultimate. This is a fight. Arrow gets bounced around by Mad Life, but there is a great Azir ultimate into the fray. Arrow exhausted on the backside, but Space is gonna die first. Ambition three man play for Pickaboo, and this is gonna be some great cleanup as Arrow gets lanterned in. Three kills for none. But no, that was his lens, so yeah. he was seen. So lens used in the bottom side. Now lens used by Pickaboo to make sure they don't know. Up oh, oh, here we go. Ambition's gonna pop the Agony's embrace. Flash immediately from Pickaboo. But Coco's already roaming. Score has to chrono break back in. There's a stun coming through there with the parallel conversions, but it's just not gonna be enough. By CJ Entis. Now they have a lot of wiggle room on this Baron. Well, or I Dragon, rather, and they have right away. Okay, so here come the TPs, Nar TPing behind, Maokai TPing there as well, so there's oh, a parallel ambition. convergence. Can they get anything? Ambition gets caught in the pit. He's gonna die, and actually that is going to go over to Victor. Coco taking it in the end. Arrow still on the outside. Arrow has the exhaust on him right now, but it doesn't look like Mad Life's actually gonna get out of that one. Amazing hook onto Helper, but Pickaboo yeah. dies in flight. Can they take out Helper before he turns into Meganar? The answer is no. The biggest threat on CJ. Looks like we're just going to trade turret for turret here. Pickaboo going to just walk in and chain CC ambi Ambition. Okay. All right, more wave for coming out. Someday threatens with the Righteous Glory. Uh, score actually gets bounced around by Mad Life. Helper's coming in. Helper is exhausted on the front line. Pickaboo, the first to die. Ambition actually finds the flank. Someday low. They have to back out of this right now. Someday has to flash. And Coco still chasing. Ooh. Has the death ray. Doesn't get the second hit on the death ray the Sivir, but Victor's still going to be doing a lot of damage. Yeah, we'll see. Not much MR yet. Oh, okay, Mad Life went for the, went for the engage. The yeah, but there's for. the TP. Ooh. Ambition just gets caught and destroyed. Arrow with the kill. Top side of the jungle, maybe possibly going for a pick. And he, oh. oh. Yep, okay. so the Legion probably, I would assume, the Echo. Oh, here they go. Yep, that. TP going in. They want to take this. Arrow's already at 50% HP. Took a few Baron shots. And now, someday, going to eat a death ray from over the pit. Are they going to be able to get this box already so. down? They've got the zone. Yes, they will. There's no way for CJ to get in. They're going to try and team fight right afterwards. Space free in the back Ooh. line. Coco getting tied up by Someday. Someday just all, all over Space and Coco in the backside. Vayne still very high HP. Someday not dead yet. There's Someday. He's going to take out the Gnar. And it looks like it is one for zero. No double kill, actually. Helper escapes. Yep. So as long as Arrow doesn't misplay that, he should be able just to kill the Gnar. Oh, Pickaboo misses his hook. Oh, that was a pretty key death right there. Pickaboo gets caught out and dies. Huge pick for CJ Entis. Now can Someday get away? Has to use the Righteous Glory. Helper now. Uh, oh, Mad yeah. Life is here, but this Baron's going to go down super Hopper fast. Needs to keep in. Here he goes. And there we go. Ambition going to get locked up with the hook. There's the Baron. Goes over to score. Can CJ turn this fight around now? Ambition has the Maokai on top of it. Maokai very low. Someday has Pickaboo's to flash very out. Low. Helper's Helper in the on back. the side. Oh. But there he goes. Nice star. Pickaboo's going to die. And well Helper is still alive and available. Azir ult used to block off the choke. And that is going to be a Baron for poked a little bit also. I don't know if Peekaboo wants to do this. Big there is flank. a good ultimate. Ambition, though, is going to get out. Is he? He's going to get hit by the stun wow. from Echo. Echo is not going to be able to do much. Helper still rolling through. Helper in the Meganar form. And b as big as uh, Mad Life is on that all TP, they're going to go on to Coco. Oh, they're going to try and get the hit. Someday there in the back line, he comes through. TP coming through with her helper as well. Ambition caught out in the front line. He d he's trying to stop them. Had his ult down. Someday oh, already Nar. quite low. There's the Nar. crowd control coming in for Pickaboo. Nar is still there. Nar is still alive. Vayne is by herself. Oh. Vayne's going to flash the Nar ultimate. But Space manages to take out Thresh. It's a one for zero right now. There's the slow. Can they oh, get God. more space coming through? Emperor's Divide, but they're going to go right onto this Baron. 
so many ultimates used. And Ambition, once again, living by a sliver of health. Ambition had a great ult to stop them from actually engaging onto Coco. That means CJ is going to get this Baron. There is no contest. Means that KT can just wait out this Baron, more than likely. And you know, someday goes in on Helper. Oh Helper wow, getting Helper low. taking a lot of vein damage early. Now Arrow in the back gets onto Ambition. He's and Mad Life now. is in the front line still. Uh-oh, KT turning this around. There oh is Nogde killing Coco. This is probably going to be a KT. Arrow ulting down the mid lane right now. Ambition pops his ult. A little space bit late, but Space is all alone and dead. And oh KT dear. can probably just charge through. The carries are dead. The wave clear is gone as Someday finally finds the pick on to Helper on the mid lane arrow just moving through the enemy team. Yeah, and you know, CJ Anthos can't wave clear this. They can't contest this. All the damage dealers for KT is up. I, what is KT going to do? They're just waiting for that minion wave to come in. Yeah, they don't even really need it. I mean, Maokai is so tanky right now, but they're still just waiting. They're hesitating. Well, there's still Here 40 seconds. They have a lot of time. So they're going to try and get the damage down, but they're, they're just a little bit afraid at the moment. They have a big minion wave. They have to end here if they don't want this to go even longer. Oh boy, this is looking very Parallel dicey. convergence means they're going to get one turret. And okay, here, here they go, go on a number two. There is the exhaust onto Helper. Narl not really doing much of anything. Oh, Arrow's still game. there. That's going to be it. They focus down the Nexus. KT will take game two. And it comes down to one. Right. No, they have to be so cautious here. Mm -hmm. The junglers are really the only people with Ooh. items. Oh, oh, oh this is the taunt, actually. Helper gonna have a chance to hop out of this one. Parallel Convergence not going to land. He is slowed up by the Time Winder. Where's the next taunt? There's a flash coming in. Oh, Two yeah. flashes for the first blood on to score, and Ambition just nowhere close them in the top side, because Bigaboo decides to flash Flay while he has a Shen ult yeah. on top of him. It could be very bad for Corky and Alistair. Coco gonna run to score. Pelicumber just goes down. Doesn't get the stun. There's the Shen ult. They want to get onto Coco. Nogne's gonna follow up. Nogne over the wall. Coco actually gonna dodge the uh, Azir ultimate. Now score getting low. Summoner heal going to save him oh. from Nogne, but Nogne gets a kill onto Ambition on the follow-up. Someday will escape. I'm, I'm okay. Wow, Ambition actually has a flash score going in. He's going hard, and there he goes. Goodbye. Whoa. And not even in this case. Uh, Pickaboo's coming back around. He's going to be there, there with a Shen ultimate on it. Mad Life immediately uses the Unbreakable Will, but someday's already there, and Helper is just not in a position. And there's a hook. hook. Beautiful. Arrow has a chance to come over. If he needs to, he will. And there is Mad Life. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> he resigned himself to his fate. Yeah. To CJ. Now, is it worth it? Maybe not. Last game, I think it was. As Pikaboo gets caught out a little bit right here. There's right Ambition there. popping the Agony's Embrace. Pikaboo on the run. There's an exhaust to follow up. Coco coming through. And there, Pikaboo trying to save himself with the Lantern. But Coco flashing over the wall for the kill. Good kill. But they are deep in enemy territory right now. Remember, Someday still has a TP is up and Shen is getting very tanky. Right? Helper gonna try and fight this one. There's a Nar ultimate, but it's not gonna get a stun. Box already dropped to stop them from doing this. There we go, taunt coming through. Is there more damage? Parallel convergence over the wall. It may is not going to hit the Corky in the end, but that's gonna be a lot of disengage. Someday misses his taunt on the return. Now oh. here they're all grouped up, big chaos storm. There's a Shen ultimate to save Pickaboo. Shen just gonna taunt over, he's still in the storm. Does get out. Nogne moving forward. Arrow's here. Flash over the wall. Oh. Beautiful headbutt from Mad Life, but Arrow has his flash in return. And that means Helper's going to fall, and Mad Life will die in the end as Arrow. And they want to figure out if this ambition, Evelyn, is still on the flank, which she is. They have to do this quickly. Helper still has TP. Yep. And they probably will with the Blade of the Ruin King on the Kogma and Ambition scene. Yeah, they want to find it. They see yes, Ambition. Flash. There's a hook. Oh. They catch him out. Ambition is going to fall. Wild score picks up the Baron. So early Baron from KT Rolster on the strength of that fight. Ambition.
Reaper and the Triforce and the Blade. Here we and go, here we TB go. coming in. They want to get onto Arrow. Can they do it? Great engage. Arrow gets nearly blown up immediately, and there they go. They Ooh. get the kill onto the Kogma, shutting Arrow down. Score on the run right now. There he goes. Falls before they can siege the turret. So Helper takes damage, but then immediately TP's back in for a counterplay. Now they have TP disadvantage. How far can CJ push this? The Azir is still up. And right now, Here comes ambition. ambition. There's the TP coming in from the side. They have the home guard. Can they, they win the fight? They all end on this. Arrow so safe in the back line, face of the mountain. And the Shen hold on him. He's going to flash back and then keep on auto attacking. No threat on the Arrow. Arrow is just going to kill everyone after that. KT so ready for that play from CJ. CJ with the Hail Mary attempt. They wanted it, and now someday oh Coco hunting. Coco tries to run away with the speed boost, trying to delay as much as possible, and dead. Flashing with the sod, oh, Coco. Not looking too happy about that one. Score just gonna pop in with the phase dive and see if he can get that last little bit of damage out. Oh, we're doing uh, a lot of damage. Yeah, they have to blow summoner heal. They should just be going for the win right now. They have Baron empowered minions. No reason that they have to deal with Helper. And they're gonna get decent damage. They're probably gonna take this no, turret right it. now. They have a machine. No yep. problem. Oh, oh Ambition yeah. gets hooked and boxed into the side. Score doesn't want to finish off that kill yet, though. They're trying to prevent the flank. Helper's oh, about man. to turn into Meganar, but how much will it help? Arrow gets stunned in the back, but he's under the Azir turret, and there's Shen the Shenold. He it does die, but Nagde is Ooh. full HP. They committed so much that that is a triple for Nagne, and quadra. that is a quadra. Is Nagne going to get the Penta? Oh, He's coming someday. in, they want it. What? 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 No! What? Penta the kill. kill! And there it is, going back to the turret for the worst Penta kill camera work <laughs> that I've ever seen. It was so easy, all you had to do was focus on Nagne. Someday oh, does no. land the taunt, and that'll be a Penta for Nagne. And with that, KT Rollster takes a 2-1 victory in style with a penna kill to top it off at the end. Well played, GG. Yeah, and this KT still looking a little bit rough as they acquire. <laughs>
Trey sacrifice. Doing just what he always does, playing very far back, not getting a lot of farm, but just being there to stuff turret dives. And there we go. Sibirol comes through. Maokai in a bit of trouble. Nice kick. And there's the twisted advance. Beggy coming in right now, but we still see Chaser doing that damage. Maokai finally dies as they kite out with this Zerath and the Boomerang Blades. SKT still moving forward. Alistair and Corky on their way up to the top side. And there's no turret there, so can Wolf make the play? Gate is up. Gate is going to not come in. Stuffed. Oh. And there's the combo. Easy Hood gets into the back line, shuts down GBM. And the players from SKT turn around the team fight. Trace can't get to the top side in time. And even if he did, there was no equalizer. Unfortunate play for Green Jenna Green Wings. And Wolf with a huge play. And SKT will go for the Baron. I don't know about this. TP's still up and Trace is there at full HP. Okay, he scares them off, but oh, Trace has to flash. No equalizer. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Trace. Bye-bye. Well, he stopped the Baron at least. Our punish for their vulnerability. Here comes the counter teleport play. Marin is there. He's in the side. He's got a T uh, just twisted advance over, and Marin is dead. He is already so tanky, though. So can he delay long enough so that SKT can take the mid tier two and tier one? He's oh, still alive. Oh, boy. He's just giving up the run around. OK, he's dead, but at what price? And you could see SK Telecom still Oh, gotcha. Oh, wow. Bang. Really far forward. And Ooh. equalizer drop, but not actually going to do much. GBM still doesn't. Poss at least has that kill pressure on the Twist of Fate. Yeah, but you have to think about throwing your, your pick a card then, because otherwise oh. you get a holy cow. Yeah, that is a holy cow. The pulverize. They're trying to disengage, but Trace is there. And, that and he is going to just get rooted in place. And oh, absolutely dear. destroyed, really to speak of. Oh man, bombs over Summoner's Rift. And here we go, and TP's coming in. Bengi and Marin on the side. TF is trying to get that flank too. Marin is here. That Marin's is... going to catch them out. There is nothing Jenner can do besides die. Oh, There's the Agony Embrace. He's even flashes onto GBF. Zareth dies. There falls Rumble and Sivir. Shut down. On to Easy Hood by Trace, but it's just not going to be enough. It'll maybe slow them up a little bit now that they don't have that Lich Bane to tank the turrets, but the Super Minion Wave is there. Great engage from SKT to close this one out. Yep, and well played by SK Telecom, and questionable draft from Jenner Green Wings this game. We'll see if they can clean up next game, but first, SK Telecom needs to take this Nexus, which they will. So, good game. Well played. Well, SKT wins game one. It, you know to me, it looks very similar to the last time they played you there. <laughs>
And here we go, Marin coming in, has that righteous glory. Jay's going to fall next. And, and this... SK Telecom, this is how you snowball a game. Absolutely beautiful. They play it into their power spike. They get the mid lane turret. They already have the vision control. Then they turn onto the Baron and try to get it in 25 minutes. You could not ask for a more precise timing of this power spike than what SKT is showing us. Well played indeed. And that is a 26 minute Baron for SK Telecom. I mean, Biggie doesn't even have smite right. They're going to have to send not, three people to deal with them. That's not really something you normally say, but in yeah. this scenario where Maokai has Frozen Heart and is now TPing, he's going to try and get more kills. They Ooh. want something. Frostweed's claim on a chaser. Jay on the side. There he's Good on. He's already on the GBM. GBM. GBM gets low. GBM already used his cleanse. And Marin is going to flash out from behind, but Pilot caught out. Twisted advanced on, and Banky grabs the kill. Trace tries to get in. Trace under the turret, though. Bang. He's to stop taking those tower hits. <laughs> There is very few ways that you can engage on it. Jay has to go all in. There he goes. Marn coming in from the flank. Nice, actually nice pull. Oh very boy. good, they destroy Easy Hood in the backside. Marn's already there though, and there's so much damage coming out of Bang. Even still, GBM gonna eat some more rockets in the end, and the, the dive continues. Exhaust onto GBM. Bang is there, Bang just gonna turn around for the double, and Wolf takes enough turrets. <laughs> They're going into the fountain. Undefensible for Jyn Air Green Wings, and here comes the collapse. More Baron-empowered minions oh, on nice. their turret right now. No one's going to be able to actually kill Marin. Well, I mean, this seems like this game's going to end with a, not a bang, but a fizzle, but Maokai nope. goes in. Nope, they're just going to dive in. They want those kills. Marin actually has to flash out. Great pull. Oh, and Trace another the back line. Yeah, there's GBM hits the Petrifying Gaze, but the Monsoon going to cancel that out, oh. and there is a devastating Shockwave to finish things off. Three members dead, only Trace and Che alive, and that's going to be the end of the game. GG, SK Telecom goes on to win their 19th best of three in a row. They improved to 12-0 in best of threes on a season.